with Ryan and sent this little jumper for Blue. <laughs> so I'm just gonna do this, put it on. He actually loves these, I think. Although the pumpkin one, he did try to eat, didn't he? So with Ryan and do a dog collection, and uh, yeah, how cute does he look? He's got his Christmas jumper. Is that going to show the camera? He wants his treat. Ew, he's the most handsomest dog in the world. Who it? <gasps> oh. Speak. Good boy, good speak. Good boy. My thumbs are like a massive tree face. But this, what, this one looks like a Christmas tree. delivery I also got these today and these are so cute for gifts I think these are Burt's Bees these are lip balms and I love 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 the lip balms I got one in my baby bundle and they are incredible and this is like a little gift set as well and in here we have the mats for what is it changing mat Gandhi born and they have so many cute things look at this so this is her cot mobile a little bit of pink everybody and then we have the moon. And we have the moon. And what else is in there? Oh yeah, and a canopy, which I'm not sure what I want to do with this, but I've seen so many online and I think it can either go around the cot or have it in a corner and put like a chair on it or a bean bag or something. So yeah, but at the moment we still can't get into the nursery. So it's quarter to eleven on Friday night and um We've just popped up to the hospital because I feel like today I haven't felt a lot of movement. I haven't, didn't feel her move at all today until about 10 o'clock tonight. I asked Adam to Google um, <clears throat> ways to get your baby moving and it said like to do jumping jacks. I drank something fizzy to give me sugar um, and I was lying, like normally when I go to bed and lie on my side she is constantly like fidgeting and turn, like really turning. So I went upstairs and laid down <clears throat> and she wasn't, like, she wasn't doing what she normally does. So basically we're up here because she hasn't been moving very well, very much today. <clears throat> Come to think of it, I don't think she's moved at all apart from at 10 o'clock today. Um, but I don't know if that's because I've just been a little bit busier than normal today and I've not noticed. But normally when I'm like sat on my computer, I'm always feeling her moving and... They're very big movements, they're not like what they were like when I was 15 weeks pregnant. So we've just come up to maternity ward and I think they're just going to do a little scan or something. So, fingers crossed. She's just a very tired and lazy baby. So they have put me up, put me up to a, um, like a heartbeat monitor and she's fine. Um, <laughs> looks like this. And then her heartbeat is on this screen and they're going to leave this hooked up for 20 minutes um, and it prints out her heartbeat on this piece of paper and yeah so she has a good healthy heartbeat everything's fine it's better to be safe than sorry i very much could get into a habit of just leaving things and not wait until the next day but the thought of her life is in my hands for something that I can just come up here and get checked or wait till the next day and it'd be too late so but yes we have a happy baby happy baby she must have just been very lazy today everything was fine we was up here for about an hour but at least my mind is at rest because it's not the first time I've noticed her during the day. She's not as active as she is at night. Um, but that's, that's obviously her, her pattern, but today was just not nothing whatsoever. Um, but yeah, it's so funny being there because obviously there's people in labor and poor Adam, like hearing this woman screaming, like, oh, I think it's frightened him. It's frightened me a little bit. <laughs> but yeah, the people in labor screaming and, very scary. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. 
we are off to London again. I have an event this evening with Debenhams and it's at the O2 and I'm going to the capital, the capital Jingle Bell Ball. So there's like um, Dua Lipa, Sam Smith, um, who's the other one I like that's like Sam Smith? Um, what's his name? I met you in the dark. James Arthur um, and so I'm really excited to see them too they're like my favourite out of the list tonight I had to pick a dress from Debenhams if you watched last week's vlog I went into store and they didn't have um, Coast which was the concession I wanted to wear Coast online also couldn't come next day's delivery so I ended up going for a dress from Mango which I will show you later and I never actually knew that Debenhams stopped Mango clothing so tonight we're staying at the Chelsea Harbour Hotel in Chelsea so that'll be nice we've got a spa treatment when we get there so I haven't done my hair or makeup but I might say to them actually not to touch my hair because I don't I can't be bothered to wash it and then get ready all in all like this was all just planned yesterday I was just gonna go up on my own and get the train um, so yeah nice little surprise for us so very excited Blue's gonna go see Nanny you're gonna go stay with Nanny 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 gives him lots of treats I'm pretty sure she just cooks for blue. <laughs> so we've just arrived at the Chelsea Harbour Hotel. <laughs> this is such a hidden gem. We've arrived and we're just going to order some food to take up to the room. We've not seen our room yet, but we've not had breakfast, we've not eaten, and it's 12 o'clock. We was a little bit longer than normal to get here. So every they have a suite. Every room is a suite. Is that what you said? Every room. Yeah, every room is a suite. We've just come up to our room on the seventh floor. And our suite, I keep saying room, but it's a suite. And look at the view. So this is Chelsea Harbour. It's beautiful. We're so lucky it's a sunny day as well. It's so nice. And I've not been into the bedroom yet. So we have a little station to get ready over here more views the view is my favorite it's like being back at home we've got a harbor at home the bathroom oh marble I love marble yay here I am if you look very closely or if I zoom in you can see the London eye just over there room service is here oh your burger looks good Adam fish and chips ooh, ooh, ooh. skinny fries so I've just got out of my massage and oh my god that was the best pregnancy massage I've ever had <laughs> she'd done half an hour on my feet and then I asked if she could do perhaps my my hands because in Thailand I loved getting a hand massage rather than a facial because obviously I fake tanned and it will all scrub off I rolled on my side and she done my back, all my pressure points. Oh, it was amazing. Now I've got half an hour to get ready for the ball tonight. <laughs> Let's go. Adam ended up driving me and then he went to the cinema while I went in and he waited for me. So 
that he could take me home as well. Then as we were going through Chelsea, I had intended to photograph this for Debenhams outside Harrods or like um, the Ivory, the Ivory Chelsea I think it's called. I didn't bring my flash with me so the cameras, the photos all came out blurry. So we come back to the hotel and also the dress. So we got a few that was okay outside the Ivory but my dress was all creased from sitting in the car, like overly creased. I got back to the hotel, I've just ironed my dress and we've just gone down to the um, hotel lobby to take some photos by the tree but they're just not what I imagined. It's so frustrating, so I wanted them, um, I wanted like the shoot to be night time and very Christmassy with all the lights twinkling in the background and yeah, I don't have my flash so that can't happen and the iPhone camera wasn't doing, doing any justice so a little bit disappointed. I might just have to shoot the, the dress in daytime and Yes, I don't know, we'll see, see what happens, but it's midnight now and the thought of getting up early just to go and shoot this dress in the cold. We shall see, but now we're going to order some room service because I'm a little bit hungry, um, but had such a good night this evening. Um, I'm so happy I saw Craig David, he was incredible. So a huge thank you to Debenhams for a really, really good night. There was about 20 other vloggers there as well in a VIP box and it was just incredible. It was really, really good. And the baby who loved it, she was moving around so much. She loves house music. So I'm going to go get some food now and just chill. And I'm sure Adam is so tired as well. He's been driving so much. Let's go. 7 o'clock, breakfast has arrived. So we're just going to have breakfast in bed um, before hopefully heading back out before 8 o'clock to get some photos at sunrise and then head back to the hotel room straight away because I'm going to be in last night's dress and it's going to be freezing and it's raining today and it's supposed to snow. 7.15, pitch black outside. We're going to go get photos. I haven't even done my makeup but I'm just hoping it's all about the outfit. Um, I feel like I'm doing the walk of shame but Hopefully, hopefully the photos come out good. This is he's such a good boyfriend, isn't he? <laughs> he's avoiding the camera. Okay, and I'm so sick of this dress now. <laughs> so this is the location I wanted to shoot at, and this is the Ivory, um, the Ivory Chelsea Garden, and it's a restaurant. The lights were still on, but it's teeming with rain, and it is about to snow. <laughs> we got the shot. Poor Adam is drenched. Luckily, he had a hood, and luckily they had um canapes like so I didn't get wet either but Adam was getting wet but he had his hood up but then he couldn't see he had to get into the road to get the photos <sighs> but they're good they're really good so back to the hotel room and I might even go back to bed <laughs> so we got back into bed and we're just lying here now watching the snowfall it's still coming down <laughs> you? I wish I could film Adam in his robe like mine goes all the way down to the floor and on him it comes up to his <laughs> above his knees <laughs> um, we're just heading down to the spa it's 11 o'clock now so we've been just lounging in bed watching sunday brunch and now we're gonna go for a swim we almost forgot that we were going for a swim didn't we and we've got lunch soon at the hotels so we have got ready we went down for a swim came back showered and just got ready we're gonna go down for lunch now and then we are going to just pop to Harrods. We were going to do Winter Wonderland, but it's too miserable. It's wet, it's raining now, the snow's gone, it hasn't stayed. I thought I'd just show you what I'm wearing. This jumper is from Next. These collots are from River Island. They don't have a zip vest and not anything. They're just elasticated, so they're not maternity. Both of these aren't maternity. And then my Next um, over-the-knee boots, so to keep me warm, because there's a big side split here. So we're starting with dessert and look at this, never seen anything like it. We're not going to eat dessert first, I just wanted to know what to save myself. I'm not a fish fan but I'm sure Adam will devour all of this. not sure if you can see, no you can't, but it's snowing heavily again. <laughs> It's, not heavy, it's, heavy. <laughs> it's quite heavy. It's not heavy so. This video doesn't do justice because you can't see anything. But that is quite—they're big. They're big chunks. If it's heavy, you'd be able to see it. 
I think I think it is very heavy for December. Like, look, I can't show you because you can't see it. You wouldn't even see it if it was heavier. Than it's clear, but if it was setting, it would be thick right now. It would be like being back in Switzerland. It's heavy, it would sit. No, it's not setting because the floor's wet. The floor has to be dry. It's rain. Just having a roast now, it's after some starters. And look at this. Nice. So, brunch was very, 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 very good. I had a roast dinner with chicken, and they had beef and lamb, and oh, it was so good. And then for dessert, I had a plate of chocolate fudge cake. I had a big bowl of chocolate sauce that you just could pour on and I'm I, I did pour it on I even took the spoon that was in the chocolate fudge and swapped it we've left um, Chelsea Harbour Hotel now and we are heading to Harrods just to go and feel festive great Adam to get this coat <laughs> I, mean, I like it I like it <laughs> it looks pretty girly <laughs> Imagine sending your kid to school with this. I mean, how do you know? What was that? Yeah. What was that? It feels like blue. <laughs> so when we go skiing, put a little baby in there. Oh, look at the pockets. Oh, these are cute. Oh my god, look at this. The the one, yeah, is that? No, the one next to it, the other side. Look at that little dress. Okay. <gasps> green baby. Little scarves. The baby girl. See you later, London.